The total deaths will appear like right about now. I would just imagine Mario just being stripless. <laughs> Like strutting his own stuff. <laughs> well, Peach totally teach Junior a valuable lesson, and the princess is saved. And it's all thanks to Mario and me with the awesome good old Grand Star. And we're back to, and you're back to where you started. Yep. And Bowser's center of the universe of his galaxy is about to be blown up by, by, like, you know, saving Princess Peach and all. Yeah. Bowser is so dizzy and unconscious. Well, not exactly, but he's actually weak, though. Ugh. Okay, seriously, this is like hot and like bullcraps in here. Like, what is going on? Well, we're in a lava area and it's absolutely a pretty hot place. And Bowser, I mean, he's pretty a hot dude. Well, not like a sexy hot. No, my galaxy, my emperor, this can't be happening. <laughs> well, well, he is absolutely in a place of a mag, in, the, in like a lava magma. Like, like, it's like a radiant, like, seriously, a slash thing. Oh, boy. There goes the Grand Star. <laughs> Everything is about to crash. Like the observatory and, oh, that and, and the, and, yeah, the airships. You never saw them again. <gasps> oh, my God. It's this it. No, Mama. What? Are you serious? The Lumas are sacrificing themselves. Oh. Try not to cry, folks. And, like, seriously. I'm about to cry for the next few minutes. Wow, Reed! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I almost cried right there. Like, what the crap? <laughs> well, yeah, like what Rosalina said, they're proud to become stars, galaxies, and... Oh my crap, the baby cried. <laughs> it's so annoying. It is annoying. Do you hear the baby stars? These newborns will grow up to become galaxies someday. It sounds like a baby goat. <laughs> when stars die, they turn to stardust and scatter across the cosmos. Eventually, that stardust reforms to create a new star. And so the cycle of, uh, of life continues. Mm-hmm. But the cycle never repeats itself in quite the same way. Mm -hmm. So, you'll see. <laughs> Mario is like, wanted to know. Yeah, he does. <laughs> I was about to say something else, but I freaking failed. But, we did it. And Mario was back to where he belongs. Mm. <laughs> that butterfly in his hat. <laughs> mm. There's do there's doves like white birds. Yeah. <gasps> hey, there's the whale! And there's that robot dude. It's back to normal, ladies and gentlemen. Yep, it sure is. And there are the bumblebees. And there's my boo! There's the honey queen bee and the pr and dino piranha with the toads and the pumpkins. And there's the cheap cheeps. And Peach finally woke up. Were they just unconscious? Um, yeah. 
And there's Bowser, still dizzy when he woke up. Oh my crap, Bowser, when will you ever learn? Fireworks. Yes, all new life carries the essence of stars, even all of you. Oh. What do you have to say to that, Mario? And that was when Super Mario Galaxy 2 was released. Yep, with all the new galaxies that we just went to. Yay! Yay! We did it! The staff credits are here, finally! Yay! So, Reed, what did you think of this game? Oh my crap, it was an awesome game! I, like, quite enjoyed that. Well, that's awesome, Reed. But we're not quite finished yet, ladies and gentlemen. We still have extra episodes for us to do. Like the purple coins. And the library. Where Rosalina tells us the story all about her. Yes. And how, when she was absolutely in the galaxies. Like, why? Like, I wonder why she lives in the galaxies. And I wonder why that she has Lumas. Yeah! It, and Reed doesn't even know about this story. No, I clearly do not. But this is going to be a real surprise for me that Wim will know. Yep. I mean, I love Super Mario Galaxy. It's such an awesome, beautiful game. Yeah, it, it absolutely helps to some people and whenever you want to have a Let's Play or something. Yes, that is so true. I mean, it absolutely helps to everyone. Like, have you ever, like, want to have a relaxing station game where there's music and awesome levels of what you will discuss? Cover, and all the bosses and all of the good old familiar faces that you've seen. But, and of course the power-ups too. You can't go wrong there. Yeah, so many galaxies for you to absolutely explore. So, what is your guys' favorite galaxy? I really want to know. Like, what is your favorite galaxy? I love that picture of that Mario of the Ice. It's so good. Um, does this mean where Lala loves Melty Molten Galaxy? No. <laughs> Just no. <laughs> yeah, you know how a bunch of depth that you've been having. <laughs> I know! It was actually a real struggle! And again, it was, he had to admit that was funny. Yeah, come on, girl! Yeah, I do say it's actually really funny. And I, I have to, like, you know... Uh, uh, it's actually very embarrassing to actually see me struggle. But come on, Lala! I mean, if you're in such an, an embarrassment pickle, just laugh it out! Yeah, just laugh it out. It's what everyone's supposed to be going through. Well, whatever they absolutely say was not an embarrassment for me. It was actually quite rude for my family, but... <laughs> hey, it's my boo! You always love Junior, do you? Yeah, he's actually one of my favorite, favorite all-time favorite characters in every Mario series. Like, seriously. Well, even though he was actually in Mario Kart Wii, we can always agree on that. Oh yeah, totally. You can play as Junior any type of game, including the Koopalings. Oh, I love them too. Like, it's very cool. Well, this was an awesome good old experience for us to do. Yeah! The end. What does it have to say now? Thank you so much for playing my game. Well, I was about to say when Mario's supposed to say it. Yeah. A new chapter has been added to the storybook. The purple comet has appeared. 
And that is clearly of what I just said. So now, we are not going to be doing the Purple Comet Galaxies for this episode, but you see that crown? That means we're complete the game, but we're not complete yet. We have to, oh, welcome back. I knew you would return eventually. Please, look down at your feet. Sure. Whoa. We need 15. This number you see represents the number of power stars you need to access another world. Oh, yeah. Another world. That's right. Whether you succeed or fail, just attempting the challenge will show something about your character. Yep. We just need 15 stars and we'll access to another world. And if we talk to this black Luma right here, we have a purple comet here at the terrace. But we're not going to be able to actually do that for this episode. So this has been like an awesome good old completion. Yeah, this really has been a completion. So, this has really been an awesome game. Yes. And Mail Toad, shut up! Yeah, we do not want to hear your ring a ding 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 noises again. Yep. So, um, this was a lot of fun. Yeah, this really was. So, um, thank you all so much for watching. Give a like and subscribe. And make so sure you hit the bell so you get notified every time whenever we upload a video. Because we upload videos every Monday through Friday, except Saturdays and Sundays, if it's only necessary. Like a holiday, or a birthday, or a season. And no haters, please. And we will see you guys tomorrow for more videos. And we will see you guys when we will upload an extra episode for us to do Purple Comments of the Galaxies. So, this is um, all of us saying stay colorful. Yeah, stay colorful. So, bye everyone. Bye. Bye. See you later, guys. Uh